Melissa. In this video, we're going to talk about perf cuts. I get more questions about perf cuts on the BN2 than probably anything. I think the confusion stems from the fact that um, in Flexi Designer, it seems to be a pretty obvious miss that the perf cut settings are not displayed. Even if you only have a perf cut line set instead of a kiss or a contour cut set, it's like, where are my settings for this? So um, there are a couple of things that you need to know and be aware of, and I'm going to show you uh, what that looks like in uh, the utility and Flexi and then what the end result is. Okay, so I will open up the file. I'm just going to pick something that I have easy on my computer right here. Just this logo here, I'll open it. And let me just add a cut line by going to effects, contour cut. And I'm going to make it a um, perf cut line, actually. So I'll click OK. And then I'm going to send to device. So I'm going to click the send to device. It is ready. I am only going to be printing and cutting the objects. I will go to print parameters and make my selections here, which I've already selected, you know, kind of what we're doing. Uh, cut controls, nothing needs to be done here. I will tell you that this is for kiss cut. Um, the perf cut settings do not show in here, but it should still perf cut because we've set the perf cut line. So we'll click OK, and then we will tell it that we want to send to print and cut. So let's watch this. Okay, so the, the printing is now finished. So you can tell by the way that the blade is moving, how it's not moving, moving in one smooth line. That's kind of cutting, picking up, cutting, picking up. That is the perf cut because with perf cut, you do need part of the material to stay attached with a little tab. So when the blade picks itself up, that is where it's creating the tabs. And when it is complete, then we'll be able to just pop out the decal, just as you can see that other one that I printed and cut earlier already did. Okay. So again, those perf cut settings were missing in, this is still attached, so I'll pull that out, but those, those, um, those perf cut settings for some reason do not show in Flexi Designer, and I think that's um, something that's pretty obviously missing in Flexi. So, but as you can see, when the cut line is there, when the perf cut line is there, it does actually perf cut. Okay, so this one worked out okay, and obviously a perf cut correctly, but what happens if you need to adjust your perf cut settings? So you cannot get to them through Flexi at this point. That is feedback that I have provided directly to Roland, but that doesn't mean that you can't uh, make the fix. So my suggestion is to actually um, export your image completely. So it will export with the cut line. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to File, Export, and we will just export this. I'm gonna put a use at the end of this because I already, have, as you can see, I already have one here. So I'll click save. That is exporting this design, as I said, as a PDF with the perf cut line so that VersaWorks can see it. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna, we've got VersaWorks open. We're gonna go to file, add job to queue. I'm gonna pull it into QC. Um, because I, that's just the queue I'm using right now, basically. Um, and it will go to the bottom of QC. Now, what you can see, here is my design, uh, or my image, a PDF, and the special items, it only is showing a perf cut line. So that's exactly what we want. So if you had both a perf cut line and a kiss cut line, it would have these two. But we only have a perf cut line on the one that I was just doing. So what you can do is now you can right click on here and VersaWorks is going to give you some more advanced settings. So this is why I love Flexi. I love the ability to be able to uh, send directly to the device from there. But if you need any type of advanced settings, you definitely need to come over to uh, VersaWorks. So from the job settings, you can go into job control, cut controls, and here, what do you know? These are your actual perf cut settings. So we, this is what it was set at originally because what you can't really see is it's, we're all working together in the background. The utility, Flexi, VersaWorks. It, your jobs are actually from Flexi going through VersaWorks. It's just you don't have to 
go in there directly yourself. But what's happening is these are the settings that it's using. So if you need to adjust them, for example, if the force is not enough, then you can come in here and adjust it. Um, and th so this is where you'll find that. The other thing that you may need to adjust is your blade itself. I highly recommend using a 60 degree blade and making sure that the blade depth itself is not any further out than the, the um, thickness of a, a credit card. And that really is going to give you the best possible results with perf cut. If you need to adjust your perf cut settings, you do need to move out of Flexi and you need to move into VersaWorks because you will have money more cut controls, including for not only the, the contour kiss cut line, if you have that set, but also uh, the perf cut line. All right, guys, if you're looking for more tips, tricks, and tutorials for Roland, for VersaWorks, for Flexi, BN2, BN, BY20, I've got all that stuff. I've got playlists. I also offer one-on-one -on -one help through Silhouette U. You can get a seven-day free trial and I hope to see you in all these places. See ya.